How we doing, Quinch Raiders? What is going on, fam? Gonna look at Aptos APT on that ticker. Now, earlier today, did make a tweet showing a picture of this chart on the daily, talking about what a good setup it is. So do want to do a video and cover that, especially what we're looking at and pretty much some of the possibilities and setups and what some of the signs are, basically, that we are looking at to basically kind of think that this is a pretty good setup. So yeah, if you didn't catch this yet, make sure you are following me here over on Twitter or X at coin underscore trades is the handle. Do look forward to chatting with everyone over there. Do post a little bit more frequently and provide a lot more updates over there. So definitely make sure you are dropping me a follow here over on Twitter or X. So yeah, like we said, although we did have prices slip back down a little bit below, we did have a very nice defense on top of this 26 period EMA. In addition, also have a complete taper off and decrease in bearish volume on this two day chart. So starting off with some of the biggest volume that we've actually ever seen on this chart so far. So a peak volume coming in, tapering off, does show selling exhaustion. And that's one of the reasons why we have very nice levels of defense right here on top of 786. So if we do lose 786, then that's probably going to be a bad sign just because it was so relevant here in the past. So now in addition, we also can draw an effective trend line here coming down and basically dissecting and intersecting at this whole point. So also have a little bit more downside support based on a lot of this tightening range for Aptos chart. So as you can see, ran up, set our high, set our low, lower high, and then tightening range, finally had our explosive move to the trick. If we do, in fact, rally up from current levels to that high point, we're looking at about a 15% gain, more or less. But if we do actually zoom out, then beyond that, we're actually looking at several big targets to the upside on top. So most likely around the $10 level. And that's pretty much what we're expecting, especially since these exponential moving averages are in fact in a bullish formation so the trend keeps back testing these and we do make higher highs and higher lows and so when we look at charts especially on the longer term as long as they are doing that and still finding longer term support on top of these exponential moving averages that's a very good sign to show that the path of least resistance and the momentum also if you did enjoy the video please hit the thumbs up like and subscribe if you have not done so just yet do drop me a follow over on twitter or x at coin underscore trades but otherwise, that will go ahead and wrap it up for now. So I do appreciate all continued love and support as always. Stay safe, take care, and I'll catch you back in the next video.